Turn two. Bigger surprise at not making the chase. Cousin Carl or the shrub? I guess really, for me, it has to be Edwards because he just never did anything all year. I mean, just was just a nothing year. I mean, he's had enough points to be in contention for that that last spot going in the last couple races. Uh, but to me, he never seemed as much of a threat as Kyle did all year. So um, I think Carl is the one, you know, after the way he finished last year, basically finishing in a tie for the championship with Tony Stewart, uh, I, I'm shocked at how poorly the 99 car did this year. I think there was a lot more, again, you talk about expectations of the race, you talk about expectations of these two people, and I, I have to agree with you on, on Carl Edwards because – for a slightly different reason, though, he really curtailed what he was doing nationwide series-wise. Mm -hmm. He was concentrating on the Cup Series. You know, you thought for the whole world that this was going to be the year. You know, the only distraction he had was the, the work that he was going to do for ESPN. But other than that, you yeah. know, he was focused on the Cup Series. And it, like you say, it just absolutely 100% fell flat and boom. See, I think the thing that, that, that cost him his chance was um – Bob Osborne having to duck out of that car. Even though they hadn't done well up to that point, I still think Osborne has been the glue that's held that team together for the last four years. And one of the things they had going into this year is they were one of the teams that really hadn't changed very much. Right. And I, I was shocked that they didn't get it off to a better start, but I think I would have hung with Osborne myself. Now, Bob has a physical problem of some kind. We don't. I don't know right. exactly what it is, but I, I think that's really was the key there. But uh, I Roll them out there. Shock, yeah, whatever. <laughs> 